Tropic Lightning, everyone. Major General Marcus Evans here, Lightning 6. As I said in the uh, opening comments, Lightning 7 is uh, back on the mainland for some temporary duty. Look forward to uh, getting the Command Sergeant Major back. Uh, hey, a lot going on this past week here at, uh, here at Schofield Barracks and across U.S. Army Hawaii. We were honored at the beginning of the week to host some distinguished visitors here, starting off first with the Under Secretary of the Ar Army, Honorable Gabe uh, Camarillo, just a superb opportunity for him to come and visit U.S. Army Hawaii to visit specifically the 25th Infantry Division. We had the opportunity to show him a lot of our infrastructure challenges, show him what we have set up for the upcoming Joint uh, Pacific Multinational Readiness Center rotation, which will begin in, uh, in just under two weeks. So really a good opportunity to engage with Army senior leadership. On that same day, had the opportunity to host an alumnus of the 25th Infantry Division, Governor Mike Parsons and his wife. Uh, they were coming through uh, Hawaii. He wanted to spend a little time where he had served previously in the uh, 1970s. A really good engagement opportunity to show how, how the division has evolved, but still is uh, uh, invested in the legacy of the history of this tremendous organization. And then also on that day, we had Assistant Secretary of the Navy Berger here who was looking at some of our environmental programs that we work in a partnership with the University of Hawaii in terms of protecting some of the endangered species here on uh, Oahu. So really a, a great day for the division to highlight some of the uniqueness of things that go on here at Schofield and across U.S. Army Hawaii and then talk about war fighting as we get ready to kick off JPMRC. Hey, for everyone, a few community events and awareness things that are uh, coming up. First, I want you all to be uh, aware that on s this Saturday, uh, we will have a water outage scheduled for 7 a.m. to 10 a.m. here at uh, Schofield. We've gotten the information out in various venues. If you have questions on that, uh, please let us know. But the intent of that is to do some repairs on some of our water infrastructure to, to create some resiliency in it. Uh, but again, Saturday from 7 in the morning until 10 in the morning, that will take place. Uh, as we get ready to finish up this, uh, this week, I hope everybody looks forward to enjoying a good day off tomorrow as, uh, as we take a day of no scheduled activities to prepare for the upcoming JPMRC rotation. Tomorrow night at Stoneman Field, there'll be a movie night. There'll be two movies that'll be shown out there starting at, uh, at 6 o'clock. And then also wanted to highlight the spectacular event that will occur next week on the 28th of October, also out at Stoneman Field. A good event for soldiers, families, and friends to come out and participate in, strengthen the bonds uh, here on the community at, uh, at Schofield and across U.S. Army Hawaii. Hey, right now we are focused on uh, developing uh, our war fighting readiness. Uh, that is showing every day as we set the stage and prepare for JPMRC. Uh, got a host of participants that are converging here into Oahu, also out to um, the Big Island at uh, PTA, and that will take place over the course of the next week. Uh, Third Brigade is absolutely ready to go into this uh, rotation. A lot of joint assets that are coming, uh, coming to play, so it's going to be really a phenomenal training event for uh, all, of, all involved. We do have information that has gone out to the community making everyone aware of the amount of traffic that will be moving around, the amount of military vehicles. Uh, we'll work back with the MPs and our Department of Emergency Services to ensure everybody is aware of impacts to roads. We thank you all for your consideration going forward uh, with this, but it should be a tremendous training opportunity for all of the soldiers that are participating and particularly the, uh, the Bronco Brigade. Again, hope you all enjoy a good long weekend, time with family and friends and resting up before we begin one of our most important collective training cycles here on the island of Oahu and across U.S. Army Hawaii. Tropic Lighten and strike hard.